sales for Kia Motors America, Tom Loveless. You know, in an industry that's, let's be honest, somewhat smaller than it was a few years ago, Kia has done something that's pretty remarkable. We've entered a parallel universe. That's right, one that just keeps expanding. Today, we want to talk briefly about how we've managed to grow in this tough market. And most importantly, we'll introduce you to two examples of innovation for this wonderful planet of ours. Both express Kia's approach to global sustainability without diluting the fun of driving. Now, before I continue, let's introduce the gentleman driving Kia's record-setting U.S. pace. He is group president and CEO of Kia Motors America and Kia Motors Manufacturing in Georgia, Young Mo Ah. We also have with us the Vice Chairman and CTO of Hyundai Kia Motors Company, Dr. Hun Soon Lee. Also with us today is the leader of our design transformation, Kia's Chief Design Officer, Mr. Peter Schreier. Peter. has experienced significant growth in the past 24 months and we've done it with designs that are worlds away from where they were just two short years ago. Most of the credit goes to one groundbreaking design after another. Think about it. Soul, Forte, Forte Coupe, Sorento, Sportage, the Forte 5 door, and the all-new 2011 Optima just now arriving in Kia dealerships. These seven models represent the boldest product offensive in the industry, truly transforming our brand by design. And in the process, dramatically expanding the universe of passionate Kia buyers as well. Those include a growing number of young adults, or Gen Y customers as evidenced by the fact that Kia recently ranked eighth on the list of top 10 brands purchased by Gen Y car buyers in a recent Auto Pacific study. Now, along with the barrage of new product in the past few years, you've also seen a wide array of concept cars from us as well. And if these concepts demonstrate anything, it's that the Kia design revolution is just getting started. For example, the Ray concept sparked a, a lot of interest at the Chicago Auto Show earlier this year. It also introduced a philosophy we call Echo Dynamics. Now, Echo Dynamics symbolizes Kia's dedication to creating a sustainable future through vehicles with significantly reduced environmental footprints. Kia is expanding its green car investments in R&D in much the same way we committed ourselves to quality and design innovation over the past decade. The Ray was born in our Southern California design studio and showed how we might deliver that combination in a plug-in hybrid. But Kia is developing other ideas around the globe. Right now, we'd like to share a very different concept in Ecodynamics, created by our European design team. It was conceived as a stylish city car that would be right at home on the streets of Paris and maybe even here in LA. Please welcome the Kia Pop Concept.
vehicle that provides a glimpse into the future of urban transportation. It can travel up to 100 miles with a single charge, carry three adult passengers in comfort, and be fully recharged in just six hours. And wherever it goes, it needs just a tad over three yards of parking space when it gets there. Pretty remarkable. Much of the inspiration came from outside the world of automotive design. And the results, well, they're striking. The unique oblong windows and full-length glass roof reflect the designer's wish to give the driver a perfect view of his surroundings. Much like the view from a helicopter. The designers created an interior that's more modern sculpture than it is small car. In the pot stores its energy in a lightweight lithium polymer gel battery created in partnership with LG Chem. They're incredibly space efficient. A major benefit in a small, small city car that helps the pop achieve the speed, pop speeds of up to 87 miles per hour. Now, before we look ahead in an all-new green production model, let's take a moment to underscore why we're so bullish on Kia right now. Kia has been setting one sales record after another this year. In fact, we've set records in seven out of 10 months and are right on track for our best year ever here in 2010. Even more remarkable is our gain in market share. Since we launched the Kia Soul here in Los Angeles just two short years ago, we have increased our US market share by 48%. So what's driving our success? Well, we call it transformation by design. We mean design in every sense, not just the styling of our cars, but the, the strategic investments we've made to accelerate our product quality, technology, and overall value. Take the all new Sportage, for instance. Sportage now enjoys the highest residual value in its class. That, according to the experts at Automotive Lease Guide. And its popularity has outpaced supply since arriving in dealerships just a few months ago. Our new models are also earning high marks for safety. In fact, since the launch of Soul, every one of our new models has earned top safety pick honors from the Insurance Institute for Highway Safety. Our investment in American manufacturing is also paying off. Our U.S.-built Sorento was recently named one of the best new cars for 2011 by U.S. News & World Report. Consumers are just as enthusiastic. Sorento has been our top-selling vehicle every month this year and is set to become Kia's best-selling vehicle ever, easily surpassing sales of 100,000 units in a single year. That's a first for Kia in the U.S. And while most manufacturers wait for facelifts or refreshes to make tweaks and adjustments, we're making continuous improvements to add new levels of refinement, new levels of refinement to the Sorento based on consumer and media feedback. For example, we just added dual flow damper shock absorbers to all Sorento models. That for a smoother and quieter ride over, over potholes and the like. In addition, the steering assist valving has been retuned for easier low speed operation. And we're not waiting. We're making these changes as we go in our first year of production. Perhaps the best news of all is that our dramatic product transformation will continue with the arrival of several more exciting products, including the turbocharged Sportage SX, two new special edition Soul models that were previewed at the SEMA show a couple of weeks ago. And on top of all of this, we're now preparing for our largest model launch ever, the all-new Kia Optima. With this product revolution, well, it's no, it's no wonder that Kia dealers have just given us our highest rating ever in the latest NADA dealer attitude survey. Kia now ranks number three in the industry in dealer satisfaction ahead of Toyota, Lexus, and Honda. Now, to share some new details about the family of Optima vehicles, please welcome the Vice President of Marketing and Communications, Mr. Michael Spray. Thanks, 
Tom. You know, last spring at the New York Auto Show, we introduced the all-new Optima. And since then, its design has attracted universal praise. I mean, like a well-tailored Italian suit, the Optima has an upscale elegance that is free from gimmicks. And it's with, with its roomy interior, luxury-level appointments, and class-leading combination of power and efficiency, we think it's got what it's going to take to make a huge impact in the market. So, we'll be launching the all-new Optima with the biggest campaign in Kia's history. We just renewed and expanded our successful partnership with the NBA. And this year, Optima stars as the official car of the NBA. It made its television debut just a few weeks ago during the NBA tip-off week. In December, we're going to kick off the holiday movie season with a 60-second cinema spot introducing the Optima to an audience of more than 70 million people. And then early next year, you'll see another new spot featuring the Optima when we return for our second year in the Super Bowl, the biggest television event of the year. But the best part of the Optima launch is the amazing product that's really the center of it all. As we announced in New York, the 2011 Optima will feature three powerful and efficient powertrains. First, the Optima GDI for gasoline direct injection, arriving in showrooms this month. It's our most affordable Optima, and it's going to generate 200 horsepower, the best standard power in the segment. But before I mention price, consider all the content that comes standard on this vehicle. We have the best fuel economy in the segment, keyless entry, dual exhaust with chrome tip, a great audio package with USB jacks, Bluetooth wireless connectivity for cell phones and audio devices, with steering wheel mounted controls, and voice activation. All this, plus our industry leading 10 year, 100,000 mile warranty, and the best looking design in the segment for under $19,000. A tremendous value for a very well equipped introductory model. But the story gets even better. It's, it's just as impressive, if not more, with our richly appointed Optima EX. The EX adds an amazing list of premium amenities like 17 inch alloy wheels heated outside mirrors, eight-way power driver seat, push-button start, dual-zone automatic temperature control, and much, much more. With the six-speed automatic transmission, the price for the all-new Optima EX is just $22,495, another great value. Now, adding to the Optima strong value proposition is the fact that Automotive Lease Guide has increased its 36-month residual value by 66% over the previous generation Optima, our company's biggest increase ever. Now, in the next few weeks, Kia's first ever turbocharged vehicle in the U.S. goes on sale. And while the Optima Turbo delivers 274 horsepower, which is best in class, but of course, it's going to continue to maintain our position as a fuel economy leader as well. So the 2.0 liter turbo engine will be available in the Optima EX and the SX. The Optima Turbo is going to include all the premium features found in our naturally aspirated Optima EX. And our turbo models are going to start under $25,000. That is a significant price and fuel saving advantage over the V6.